So farming as we know it's changing. It's actually probably already changed. And now it's not just about what we produce, but actually how we produce it. It's not just about protecting our environment, actually improving it. And it's not about less harm, but more good. One of the most important issues that we face as an industry is nitrogen leaching from our farmland because of the impact that has on our water quality. Nitrogen is not the only thing that affects water quality. And I reckon farmers have been making good progress through the establishment of riparian zones and fencing off waterways. And this is certainly making a difference in many catchments to things like sediment and phosphate and E. coli readings. But nitrogen leaching is still the most challenging aspect to control. No amount of riparian planting or fencing off waterways is gonna help here because as we know, nitrogen moves down through the soil profile, not across its surface. And the other thing we understand is that up to 90% of all the nitrate that leaches from our livestock systems comes from the urine patch. Doesn't come from spreading uh, nitrogen fertilizer, doesn't come from spreading effluent if those two things are done properly. It comes from the urine patch. Ecotain environmental plantain delivers a revolutionary way to mitigate nitrogen or nitrogen leaching, doing it naturally and doing it now. Ecotain, the first product from this brand called N Sentinel 4, reduces nitrate leaching from the urine patch using four independent mechanisms. As we'll see later, not all plantains have this capability or efficacy. Firstly, it reduces nitrogen concentration in the urine through a combination of a diuretic effect, which increases urine volume, and an increase in water intake via feed. So Ecotain typically has a lower dry matter uh, content than ryegrass, for example, meaning animals take in more water as it grazes, and that will increase urine volume. Studies at Lincoln University indicate Ecotain reduces the amount of dietary nitrogen which is excreted in urine compared to ryegrass. So in this table here, at similar nitrogen intake, which is the, uh, at the top of the uh, table there, there is a lower nitrogen concentration in urine and a lower N, concentra uh, N excretion per day. So if we looked at the N percent there uh, in pasture at 0.35 percent and at Ecotain 0.14, less than half the concentration. And Peter Kemp might also uh, give you some information on some of the work that he, he's been doing that demonstrates the same thing. Plant and food research studies have demonstrated that urine from ecotain fed animals slows the conversion to nitrate and therefore increases the potential for plants to uptake that nitrogen. So in essence, ecotain urine patches are slow release urine patches. Finally, the presence of ecotain plants in the soil, probably for greater than 12 months, impact on the nitrification process in the soil. So we believe that biological nitrification inhibitors in ecotain restrict the accumulation of nitrate in the soil, reducing the potential for nitrate leaching. And this is regardless of whether the animals are eating ecotain or not. So four independent mechanisms working to reduce nitrate leaching. And when we bring all of those four mechanisms together, we get quite a powerful tool. This is truly an industry solution. <laughs>